Welcome back, everybody, to another Theta Network update for September 21st, 2022. It is a Wednesday, my dudes. I hope you guys are having a great one today. Now, all right, let's go over the news. What's going on with Theta Network today? Well, first up, from Gate.io, it will support the Theta upgrade, and deposit and withdrawals will be suspended during the process. This us. This upgrade will take place approximately on September 29th, 2022 at 2 UTC time. So if you store any theta on gate.io, just be aware of that. It's going to go forward. It's because of the V3.40 upgrade that's taking place. So yeah, it's just going to be a quick pause. Once it's done, they'll give a notification when it's all ready and you can withdraw and deposit again. But yeah, if you haven't, if you do not know about the Theta V3.40 upgrade, which will go into effect, it's about Theta having wrapped Theta tokens and also, I believe, like deploying uh, staking via smart contracts. So yeah, articles right there. There's also one on Medium. So yeah, give it a listen, give it a read. Also in the news, I'm, this is from Wes Levitt. I'm excited to spend time with the Theta community at the inaugural ThetaCon with all the best Theta ecosystem projects in attendance. It should be a fantastic event. So yeah, it's been a while since we've seen a tweet from Wes Levitt. So awesome. Yeah. So he'll be there at ThetaCon December 2nd to the 4th. And yeah, spend time with the Theta community. This is awesome. Also, uh, speaking of ThetaCon and that Theta drop going on yesterday, Baller was pretty vocal, but we got to get a little tweet from Dr. Theta, who basically answered all his questions on who you are, which people run this project. Anyone with an association to official T bill, what percent of the cell goes in your pocket? Why is the official T still at the Ponzi Keeps Center at ThetaCon? Why does Theta Network need any extra funds for this gathering? Well, the funds like is from people. It's like he, the communities put this together, not Theta Network. And so, yeah, that's what that's going to. Who he is. He's a full-time physician at East Coast USA. Uh, let's see. Uh, anyone with associates to official T-Bill? No, the Theta Punks is not in any official relationship, partnership with the official T-Bill at all. Uh, what percent goes into your pocket? Zero. This is all going to the ThetaCon event. That's why it's the last Theta fundraiser. And why is official... At center, I don't know, probably just because <laughs> it's a Theta conference. Why wouldn't it be? Why wouldn't you want to be there? But then why does Theta Network need any extra? Oh, that was our answer. But yeah, he had a long, long tweet. Very respected the, uh, Dr. Theta in the community. He loves Theta Project. He loves investing. He likes to make going. And everyone uh, thanked him for this long tweet from him. Theta Doctor is a motivated person that does a ton of outreach to the Theta community. Consider him... A scammer is nonsense. His hard work and dedication shows that this is on top of his full-time job as a physician, too. And yeah, been around since the beginning of Theta Drop and Open Theta. Theta Doctor has demonstrated to be honest, enthusiasm, commitment, and integrity over the year. So, yeah, it's so like these are the people who are in like the Theta conference and what's going on. So, yeah, Baller was pretty loud yesterday. <laughs> Sometimes he just, just calls it out, but yeah so pretty cool that they doctor they had time took the time and actually wrote this and like there's they're good together they both appreciate so don't go hating on baller like i think it was right here and reach out to you what's up brother unfortunately can't he can do it through a private conversation but yeah awesome man wish you guys all the best and thank you for doing this stuff for the community it means a lot yeah brother thank you for the support and it means the best so yeah so everyone's cool so don't go out on a banning spree it's doing so much hate on baller baller just calls it out some days is how it is but yeah thank you dr theta for answering all those questions too so yeah and lastly, in the Theta News Network, Crypto Lee has another video. He's been staking Theta and T-Fuel. And if you want to follow along with his journey, it's in his latest video of Part 14 and his earnings. So, yeah, give it a listen. Give it a watch if you're new into the Theta Network. And we're just curious on how the staking process is. I'm not sure how long you've been in. I think I've been in for like over two years now, just doing those earnings as they come. But, yeah, check out his video. So keep it up, brother. And that's about it for this Theta Network update. Price of Theta is at $1.04 with a market cap of $1.04 billion. Trading volumes at $31.8 million and total stake nodes out there is 3,313. The Theta being staked to these nodes is at 60.47%. Now T-Fuel's price is at $0.051 cents with a market cap of $272.5 million. Trading volumes at $7.3 million. And total elite edge nodes out there is 7,848. The TFL being staked or locked away in these nodes is at 40.35%. Now the change between these tokens, 
State is down 0.66%, and T-Fuel is down 0.71%, so not much of a change at all since yesterday. And as always, we finish off this video with a movement of Theta on fiatleak.com slash Theta, where you can watch the movement of Theta take place, as well as other cryptocurrencies out there of your choice. But since it's a Theta network update, we are looking at Theta. Yeah, a lot of transactions happening on Binance right now. Like, what was it yesterday? Hubie? I forgot. But <laughs> yeah, so that was a shocker. But yeah, so Theta's still moving, and it's still going on. Still building, still creating in the background. And yeah, just be patient, my peeps. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. Uh, don't forget that thumbs up on your way out. Subscribe to the channel. And until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.